Hey, Kristen. Hey, Alex. What you, uh, what you got there? Oh, well, it's bringing your uh, son to work day, so it's my little boy. <laughs> it's my little boy. Okay. Yeah, a little fur baby. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Alex Farnham, and this is Animalist News. Today, we have a special guest on the show, Kristen. Hello, Alex. I'm Kristen from Stuff Mom Never Told You, and thanks for having me. Yes, it's, well, it's my pleasure. Mm. So, Americans spend more than $330 million on pet costumes and treats for Halloween this year, but that small change compared to the more than $5 billion we're projected to drop on pet gifts over the holidays. And that's partially why some folks are wondering whether pets are becoming the new kids on the block. Uh, 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 uh. Uh. People treating pets like one of the family isn't a new thing though. It actually originated in the mid 1800s when Victorians thought the ideal home ought to include a household animal. And if you fast forward today in the United States, you're likelier to find a pet than a kid in the home with roughly 67% of Americans owning pets compared to 46% of households that have children under 18. Well, that's also what some are arguing, that younger generations are now substituting parenthood with pet parenthood as it's becoming more common to wait longer to have kids or even remain childless. To which the roughly 28% of dog owners without kids would probably say, why is that a problem? Well, it isn't so much an anti-dog or a cat bias, but concerns are referring to pets as fur babies or fur children and taking them out in public as you would a child. That seems to spark the most frustration. Shut that damn dog up, I'm trying to eat my spaghetti. It's a rabbit. Whatever. It's my fur baby rabbit. Check please. Industry analysts say that a lot of this so-called pet parenting simply reflects human consumer patterns. We buy ourselves and our kids nicer, nichier things, and so that spending is just trickling down to our beloved dogs and cats and fur babies. So what do you guys think about this? Do you think pets are becoming the new kids on the block? Let us know in the comments down below. And go check out Kristen. Kristen, where can we find you? Well, people can find me over at youtube.com slash stuff mom never told you. Mm. Sounds risque. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, so don't forget to check out the other episodes over here and you can click down below to subscribe and I'll see you here in Mammals tomorrow. Thanks for being on the show, Kristen. Well, thanks for having me, Alex. Let's go uh, mosey on this way. All right. Don't forget your rabbit. Okay. My fur baby. Yeah. My baby. <laughs>